Hello everyone, it is Mystery Manny time, so let's pick some polishes. Okay, so the first polish is, this is Orly Pure Porcelain. Love this color, so pretty. Okay, let's see where we're gonna pair with that. And that is going to be, ooh, and this is Jenna Hips, I Surf With Boys. So Jenna Hips, I Surf With Boys, and Orly's Pure Porcelain. Ooh, those are pretty colors. Very nice. Okay, so those are the two polishes I picked. I will meet you back here with the completed Manny. We'll see what I can come up with. Closer look at the colors here. We have Jenna Hips, I Surf With Boys. This is a beautiful, bright pop of blue against Oralie's Pure Porcelain. This is a very beautiful, beigey, kind of porcelain-y color. I'm gonna start this Manny off with Oralie's Pure Porcelain. This is a beautiful polish. The formula of this is so on point that I only need to do one coat of this for complete coverage. The wide brush of Oralie's polishes is just awesome. It makes for great application. I'm gonna apply INM's Out The Door Top Coat here. I'm gonna do some sponging, so applying this top coat will prevent that bottom layer of pure porcelain from lifting up. Now I'm gonna apply Queen's Latex Tape here to my pinky, middle finger, and index finger. This is going to make cleanup during the sponging uh, stage here a lot easier. Now on my makeup sponge here, I'm gonna apply a strip of each polish. And now using dabbing motions and then a slight kind of up and down dabbing motion, this is gonna make sure that the colors are blended together really nicely and I'm gonna do this as many times as it takes to reach the opacity that I want. And now just using a pair of tweezers here to pull up that latex tape. I'm gonna do this same sponging on the other two nails that I have wrapped with the latex tape here and that would be my pinky and my pointer finger. When I saw these colors, I immediately thought of these cute little uh, water decals that I have of a mermaid. I believe I got these in my nail drama box. I'm not really sure, but I know it was in one of those uh, nail art subscription boxes and I really wanted to use it. So I have put this little mermaid in some water and she just slides right off the backing and then I'm just gonna apply her to my nail. She is so precious. Now with a cleanup brush in acetone, I'm just going around the edges of my Little Mermaid here and making sure that she is kind of melted onto that nail. Now with these fish scale kind of pattern, this is a full finger decal, so I just put this in the water and it slides right off that backing, same thing. And then I'm just going to apply it over my nail here. Um, I want to make sure that this is pushed down nice and smooth, all the water is out from underneath it. And again, going around with my cleanup brush dipped in acetone here, just to kind of melt it to the nail, make sure that it's all cleaned up and nice. You'll notice here that this decal is quite a bit longer than my natural nail. So I'm just gonna go around the end here with my brush dipped in acetone and that's gonna melt that little portion off. 
Now I'm going to finish this mani off with INM's Out the Door Top Coat. Not only do I love the way that a top coat smooths out gradients or sponging work, but also look at how it smooths out this precious little mermaid. She is adorable and looks flawless after that top coat. And here is my final design. I hope you guys enjoy this. I am so excited that I got to use these mermaid decals. So cute. Oh my god, I love her. Please leave any comments or suggestions below and I will see you in the next one.